Oliver Morgan, a trans teen from Tidiut, celebrates with his girlfriend Hannah after being voted prom king. Though he's dressed like a boy since childhood, Oliver only came out as transgender about a month ago. A little while after, like, really finalizing that, like, thinking about that I was really a guy, so I decided to come out, so it was pretty easy. I have a lot of people behind my back. My family supports me, my friends do, relatives, everyone. For Caitlin Strohmeyer, a transgender woman in Erie who founded the support group Trans Family of Erie, it's a sign of societal progress. When you have kids that are being accepted and being allowed to be themselves at this age, I mean, it just, it just warms my heart because they're saving themselves so many years of anguish. To see it happen in a small town like Tidiut is just phenomenal, phenomenal. Caitlin says times now are a far cry from when she was growing up. It was extremely difficult. I pretty much decided I was going to take it to my grave. And I tried to do that. I tried really hard. As for Oliver, he grew up as Olivia, but his parents always let him be whoever he wanted. Ever since uh, he was five years old, probably, dressed like a boy, always played with boy toys, dressed like uh, Batman, Superman, just because of those things, and was very insistent as a young child that I want to be a boy. I like this boy thing. I like that boy thing, you know. So not a surprise at all, but always knew I would always support Olivia or Oliver because as a mom, when I say unconditional love, I mean it. The Morgan family says the community and the school have both been supportive, though in a misunderstanding at first, the school's administration didn't realize that Oliver is trans and he was taken out of the running for prom king. But it was all quickly clarified. The concept of somebody being a transgender, we haven't talked about it much at Tidiot School, and I think for the most part, everybody is accepting of it. However, Oliver has started that conversation, something that Caitlin says is key in the fight for equality. When it comes to transgender, I mean, you're, you're looking at the very basic, the very foundation of what people see as gender, male and female, and to, to realize that there's areas in between that. She says without a doubt, Oliver's story has impacted the Tidiute community. DD Sun reporting.